Hi, uh, thanks for clicking. Time for another review, and today it's going to be about an e-juice. Watch this. Where do I? St I always say where do I start? Right. This is this is a bit of a unusual one for me because basically it's not often that it happens, but a member on YouTube, a guy called uh, Too Real For You 80, I think that's right, uh, contacted me and asked me had I tried any liquids from uh, this company here uh, because he'd watched a few of my reviews and thought it might have been something that I might have liked. Um, I had written back to him to ask as well sounds interesting but it's on the other side of the pond they don't really go ordering liquids for the other side of the pond to do reviews about and to cut a long story short eventually he actually went out of his own way bought a couple of bottles of liquid and uh, shipped them off to me it took a few weeks to get here so this one is from uh, mt bakers uh, i hadn't heard of them before actually receiving this and, and talking to the guy on youtube i should have said type into the guy on YouTube YouTube uh, and this particular one which we're going to do a review on is actually called cookie blaster I mean I mean England cookies are not a massive thing in England if you understand what I'm saying we call them biscuits over here uh, same sort of thing you should imagine uh, but it was like cookie blaster I mean I have to use my own imagination on what this is going to be about and to be honest the blaster part sort of blast a lot of people use the word blast in things like menthol and things like that so i was thinking maybe it's a menthol uh, but what i actually did is I actually went online went to mt baker nice looking website uh, by the way they've not actually sent me this um, this was sent to me by uh, a, a one of my uh, subscribers uh, i think i already mentioned that uh, looked on their website, never really heard of them before, checked out a few of the juices and the flavours and everything was alright. But what I was impressed with was at the little bottom of the website there was a little uh, uh, chat thing came up and you could talk to somebody live and it was rapid. I mean normally with them things, it's normally robots. Uh, this person was called Anne, I think she was called, uh, asked her what Cookie Blaster were and she sort of typed it back to me that it's like uh, Oreos dipped in milk Oreos dipped in milk I'm thinking bloody Oreos what the bloody hell's Oreos uh, but yeah I know what Oreos are and I have actually had one off my knee so I know what they're a bit like Bourneville over here only the inside has got uh, a white creamy middle unlike Bourneville which is like a chocolatey middle uh, and then them dipped in milk it's not something that I'd normally do. But, in for a penny, in for a pound, I thought, why not? Give it a try. Do a review at the same time. So don't forget, I never actually tasted juicy before doing the review. The bottle's still sealed, so I've got no idea what it's gonna be like. So my response is what I think of it. Now, before we go any further, I'm not a big lover on sweet, biscuity, pastry, type things although there's a few exceptions to the rule but i'm not going to let that cloud my judgment i'm going to basically this says it's like oreos dipped in uh, dips in milk know what milk tastes like know what oreos taste like so we're going to fill uh, an e bottle and we'll see what it vapes like now it's a brand new e -vod, brand new coil in it so not going to be disguised by something else that i've been vaping previously so we'll fill it up. That's very, very dark. Very dark. I smell of it. The smell of it tastes like, sorry, it smells like uh, biscuit uh, batter. Oh, we should have said cookie dough. That's probably the same thing, isn't it? So it has got a smell of, of confectionery, you know, uh, of uh, some sort of cookie biscuit. But what's gonna vape like? Only 
Oh yeah, I'm going to find out in a second. Just give me that good bit of a shake to get it going. A couple of sucks and see how it goes. Anyway, uh, to real for you, 80. I do hope that this goes well. Um, maybe not. I'll have to wait and see. Well, it's crackling away. So I'll give it a couple of toots and see. No juice coming through to it. Whoa, well that's what I like to see. It actually creates quite a big cloud. It's floating over there now. Um, so I'm impressed with that. Yep, I'm actually getting the taste of an Oreo, and what I'm getting is I'm getting the the doughiness of the of the biscuit or the cookie. It's still a biscuit to me. I'm getting a bit confused now. Uh, with a slight hint of chocolate and like you've got a vanilla cream alongside it. I mean, is that is that does that sound weird? Let me just have another go another go of that. Do you know what? I have to give it a, it's spot on. I mean, it really is exactly what it say it is. And, I, and this is from a person who doesn't really like them sweet flavors. It's not like that. It really is like I've just had a, a cream biscuit. Uh, it is an Oreo. Do you, do you understand what I'm saying? It's lacking a little bit of chocolate for me, but I mean, it's definitely the taste of an Oreo and the aftertaste and it's like when you've except you know when you've, you've expelled everything out of the way and you've got this like lingering taste just round the back of your tongue and it's it's like a milky taste so obviously that's where the Oreos dumped in milk is coming from do I like it Well, I have to be honest with you, I, and this is unusual for me because I like tobacco flavours, but that's a lot of smoke, a lot of vapour out of me. I do actually like tobacco flavours and nutty flavours as, as a rule, but to be honest, that's it's it's a it's a pleasant taste. It really is. Would I buy it? I've got to say for the change, you know, every now and then something different something to share with people i mean that's that's a really nice liquid and the other good thing about it is that it's a, it's made in the usa i mean you know it's not a chinese liquid the guys at uh, mt baker they actually make this liquid themselves or well, maybe they have it made for them but it's made in the uk with uh, sorry in the usa with proper usa ingredients you you understand what i'm saying it's it's not a cheap Chinese imitation. Now, along with this bottle, I've got to be honest with you now, they actually did send me a bottle of 555, uh, which is a tobacco one. And I have to be honest, even though I love tobacco, I don't like all these liquids that have the names associated with a brand of, of cigarette. You know, like you can get Marlboro, you can get uh, Gold and Silver, which is b and I think. Uh, and 555 and none of them taste like the actual products and that's the only that's the only downside about it they still got a tobacco flavor to them but they don't actually taste of the actual thing they, they call and you understand what i'm saying so the 555 to me wasn't my cup of tea but as i say uh, this one uh, this is just sort of like it's out there i mean it really is a good juice I ain't got anything else to say. Thanks for sending it me because at least I can vape it for the next few uh, weeks alongside the other stuff. Uh, thanks for sort of leaving a few comments on my videos. If I can return it in some way, I'll think of something and I'll try and get something back to you. Uh, that's, by the way, that message is actually for uh, too real for you 80. I 
that's an hard one, that. Don't know what his real name is. Uh, other than that, I ain't got anything else to say. I hope you enjoyed the review. If you did, please uh, subscribe to my channel. You never know, something might come up in the future that interests you. Uh, other than that, I haven't got anything else to say. Uh, once again, Cookie Blaster from uh, MT Baker. Uh, I'll leave the link on the website down below. I'll leave their links to their website down below for you to click on. Give it a try if you like the, the, the cookie type or vanilla type e-juices. Because I know you're going to love it. Other than that, thanks for watching. See you. Bum, bum, bum.